This is Lightcraft Jet Set, unified virtual production working on an iPhone. This is a Cinedy Gear News video, supported by B&H and CVP. Welcome everybody here from BSC Expo in London, and I'm here at the Lightcraft booth with Joshua. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Uh, actually, you guys just introduced a new app, which supposedly is quite revolutionary, I heard. It it's called Jet Set. W what is it? Uh, yes, it's called Jet Set, and we're from Lightcraft. Um, Jet Set is a revolutionary virtual production app that takes all of the power of virtual production tracking and, uh, and 3D scenes and packs it all directly into an iPhone, which you can mount on any camera and then do full-scale virtual production for cinema. For somebody like me who's not into, you know, like um, post-production or virtual production yet, uh, how can you explain it to a cinematographer? <laughs> <laughs> right. Well, I mean, I've got the camera right here, so I can just show you on here, actually. So, what we have here is a Z-cam and a, a nice big cine lens. But of course, the rig has the one big difference of having an iPhone mounted directly to the top, which is running the Jet Set app. The Jet Set app has a 3D environment loaded into it and does all of the positional tracking and movement of the camera. So, all of that data can be saved and then transferred into post. So if we wanted to operate this and uh, point it at a blue screen or a green screen like we have behind us here, then we would be able to uh, have a full virtual production integration with our main cinema camera. And it even calibrates as well with the cinema lenses. So it's not just tracking the position of the phone itself, it's tracking the position of the camera. It calculates an offset between the iPhone lens and the cine lens. So it knows that it's working for this camera in particular, and, and it's not just some isolated iPhone on the top. So you do get a preview with the iPhone camera, right? You, you get a real-time preview, but then it transfers that data also to the actual footage shot with the camera. That's exactly right. So on the phone, we can see our preview of our 3D scene, and uh, we can also frame correctly uh, we also have a monitor on the back for a clean feed from this Zcam, but for all intents and purposes, we can use this as a monitor to see both our real and uh, virtual scene. And then, of course, it does transfer perfectly into post and works with the footage from the Zcam, or any camera, rather. And the app will understand if I put a different lens on it, because, of course, I mean, this lens is very similar to the wide angle, uh, like the normal 24 millimeter lens of the iPhone, right? But if I, let's say, I put a 100 mil on it, what exactly? So you would do all of your lens calibrations beforehand. And uh, so if it was a 29, a 50, a 35, whatever it is, you put your lenses on, calibrate with the Jet Set app. And then when you're on set and change your lens, you just change the calibration uh, file from the app and it does the job. What's that? Give me an example of a real world scenario where I would want to use that. And how has it been done currently or up until now? Well, up until now, I mean, there's a great many tracking options out there. I mean, to, to name a few, there's obviously Cam Track, there's there's, Z, there's uh, NCAM. But the point of this is to make it not just smaller, but simpler, because this is not just a tracking option. It is also part of an ecosystem of other software. For instance, we have AutoShot, which is our software that actually takes your tracking data from the phone, then uh, syncs that automatically with your cinema camera takes and sends it out to the post-production packages that you use. Because we know people are picky about what they use. They like to use After Effects or they like to use Nuke or whatever it is. Our app speaks in that language and sends it to that software choice. Interesting. And this works with the Axoon Cineview? Uh, yeah, we're using the Cineviews at the moment to help uh, with our demo so we can get the Zcam out to the monitor that we're using. So, you know, if people are around to have a look, but. The main important piece from Axoon that we use is the CMO Pro. So that gets the video signal from the main cinema camera and pipes it into an iOS device. That's useful mainly for calibration purposes. So when you're doing your lens calibration, it calculates that offset by looking at the video from the phone and from the Z cam and looks for tracking points, common points between the two and solves for X basically. So, I mean, like last time I did something with tracking was a long time ago when you actually had to put the markers everywhere. You don't need to do that anymore, right? Why would you? 
<laughs> it's, it's automatically realizing everything. It is. It knows It knows the position of the camera and it can do all that tracking live on set. And it's doing it with a piece of technology that most people have in their pocket. So you might as well be mounting it onto your camera or using it as is because it does work on the iPhone on its own and you can record and do visual effects shots just with an iPhone or an iPad. It's quite incredible because the actual app at base level is free and can be downloaded for free on the App Store. It's called Light, uh, Lightcraft Jet Set. Or well, just Jet Set. <laughs> and, uh, but it scales up to the size of the production you're trying to work on. So if you want to work on something much larger and you have an uh, Ari 35 or whatever you're using, iPhone on top and use Jet Set. And it scales to a maximum of 80 a month for uh, cinema shooting. Okay, amazing. Is it available already? Yeah, it's available right now on the App Store. Thank you so much, Joshua. And uh, curious to see the results out of this. Um, you know, you might already have seen some shots that these guys did in the demo while we were talking. Um, it's a bit hard to grasp the concept for me, like, because I'm not in that world, but I understand what it does. And it's just amazing how many industries are actually revolutionized by the smartphone right now. Uh, it's kind of scary, but also inspiring at the same time. And yeah, uh, good luck with Jet Set. And thanks everybody for watching. Stay tuned to Synity for a lot more like this video and other interviews and reviews. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks.